I made thousands on Snapchat Spotlight. Let's talk about it. <laughs> yeah. I just can't stop winning these days. Oh, yeah. I've been surrounded by the villains these days. Yeah. Everybody around me count millions these days. Yeah. Everybody around me say I'm killing these days. Drop top four and let the cash flow. We don't never show them what it can. What it do, YouTube? It's your boy Rob Partner. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe. And let's get into this story about my spotlight earnings. <laughs> Simple and plain. I'm chopping, I'm chopping. One of my homies pull up and uh, pull up to the barbershop in a lime green BMW i8. Now this ain't no older guy. He don't own no businesses. He don't do none of that. All he do is YouTube, TikTok, you feel me? And occasional social media posts, blah, blah, blah. Now I'm not saying he don't get paid off of YouTube and I'm not, I'm not saying that he doesn't get paid off of TikTok. But what I am saying is, I know that at this time, he's not as famous as some of these other people who can afford these luxury lifestyles. So he pulls up in this BMW i8 and I'm like, bro, where you get the car from? He like, Snapchat. I'm like, what? Snapchat? I was in the dark. Hundreds of people, maybe thousands across the country or the world were already on Snapchat Spotlight. I was so late. If I was able to jump on it when he jumped on it, oh my God, I probably would have been pulling up in a Bentley coupe. But I got on it late. I'm sorry, I couldn't get the Bentley coupe. He telling me about Snapchat Spotlight. He showing me how to sign up, create my personal account, blah, 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 blah. I'm just asking and I'm looking like, what type of content do I need to post in order to get paid? I'm not a believer at this time because I know how much work it takes to generate income on social media and how much work it takes to generate an engaging fan base or a following for your content. So I'm, I'm, I'm understanding what he's saying. And I get that he telling me the bags just was falling out the sky, falling out the sky, falling out the sky. But at that time, I'm not really a believer. You just post it and the bags is just falling out the sky. Ah, shit, just burn myself. Let me put this up. I finally signed up on Snapchat Spotlight. Now this is my first week. He's telling me, bro, you gotta post, you gotta post, you gotta post, you gotta post, you gotta post. Non-stop, don't matter what it is, if it's funny, if it's not funny, just post. We don't know the algorithm. We don't know what's going on with Snapchat. They have not let us figure anything out. These are just random clips of creative content that you own. If it's not your content, high chance that you will not be paid. Those are the rules that he gave me. So those are the rules that I went by. I'm thinking all day, like, what am I supposed to post? What type of content can I introduce to the spotlight timeline that's gonna generate views and shares, ultimately money for myself? Obviously, I was thinking a little bit too hard. I'm in a barber shop all day long. I've already gone viral multiple times working in a barber shop all day long. I've already generated so much uh, income that has nothing to do with cutting hair because I got access to a barbershop all day long. So I start uploading videos of me cutting hair. It's going slow. I start uploading random videos of me eating chips. Numbers is going up. I'm starting to realize the more I post, the more people are seeing the content, the more likely I am to go viral, the more likely I am to get paid. I just said, you know what? I'm gonna start giving y'all one to two second clips of me just shaving lines through people's head. Anybody that walks into the shop, that got hair, that wanna be taken all the way off, I'm taking the clippers and I'm just filming the first stroke, pause. Video done. Next stroke, 
video done. Next stroke, video done. Oh, let's put some funny captions on it. His girlfriend's mad at him because he cheated. She paid me $200 to do this. Video done. Maybe probably about my second week on Snapchat. I get a notification. Not even a notification. I was just getting those notifications saying, hey, one of your posts are on fire. 300 views, 5,000 views, 10,000 views. But I wake up one morning in my second week of posting. This is only my second week. Thank God I had a homie that was already in the mix. He put me in this Discord chat group. I was able to link up with a lot of other creators and see like, are these guys getting paid? How much are they getting paid? What type of posts they putting up? And I always was coming with original content. Nobody could copy my flavor until after I put it out. So it was dope. I look inside of Snapchat. It says, one of your posts is likely to get paid or, or is something like that. $562 or $652, one of them. Maybe I'll screenshot it uh, when I go back. Maybe I'll post up the screenshot. Anyway. 500 or 600 something dollars. I'm like, whoa. Now maybe $600 ain't a lot to some people, but you gotta consider the fact that this was a video that was less than two seconds long. And they just gave me $600 for it. I'm a believer. At that moment, the fact that it was only my second week on Spotlight and the fact that I actually got $600 plus, or maybe a little less, I forget the actual number, but the fact that I actually got about $600 on a post that was less than two seconds long made me a believer. So now I'm going a thousand miles an hour. I'm on Snap all day long. Next week come around. $1,200 for a video that was less than two seconds long. Oh my God. I'm posting nonstop. I'm looking at my dog. He just moved into a high rise condo. He riding around in the I-8 and he is living the life. And he's telling me because of Snapchat spotlight, he's popping. Damn it, somebody coming into the shop. Okay, I'm back. I had to dip out. I had to cut somebody hair real fast. Now we can finish up this story time, okay? So like I was saying, first payment come through. Boom, I'm a believer. Second payment come through. Boom, I'm a believer. As soon as I get on that vibe, as soon as everything start coming together and I'm like, hold on, this money is endless. They giving away thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars, nonstop. See, if I would have jumped on this a few months prior, like some of my boys did, and I had no idea what was going on, man, man. But the bad part, soon as I start getting that money, Snapchat changes their terms. They don't want to pay no more. They only want to pay a small amount of creators. They're barely not giving no money away. The sucky part is I really can't even be mad because they fucking gave out a million dollars a day for months. Then gave out a few million dollars a month to creators and I came in right at the end. So I can't say it was fake. I can't say Snap is whack. I can't say they withheld no payments from me. All I can say is I got in late. I reaped some benefits, but I didn't reap the world. And some people reap the world off of Spotlight. That's my story time. I went viral on Snapchat Spotlight. I got paid thousands of dollars. It's real. I don't know how active I'll be in the future on Spotlight just because the terms just feel like you gotta do so much more work to get little payments. I get it, but I'm not saying don't do it and I'm not saying it's not a bad, it's not a good idea to do it. If you can stay consistent and you're gonna drop that footage, you never know. They might send you $50,000, you never know. Until then, make sure you like, Make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe,
and follow me on all social media platforms. Partner said it. Yeah. I just can't stop winning these days. Oh, yeah. I've been surrounded by the villains these days. Yeah. Everybody around me count millions these days. Yeah. Everybody around me say I'm killing these days. Drop top four and let the cash flow. We don't never.